Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions Crystal Opening. So, we're going to open up a bunch of six-star crystals. We've got a six-star Nexus also to open up. And I was thinking, you know what? It's not all that exciting these days to um, open up my five-star crystals because I have them all. There was only one five-star crystal, uh, one five-star champion that I didn't have that's in the crystals. And that's Moon Dragon because round two, I went for her as a six star and got her. So I never had a chance to get her as a five star. So not that exciting. And I figure I'll just get some dupes so that I can open up more six star shards. And so I did. And then that happened. I'm looking at this like, wow. Okay. That's the only new champion I could have gotten. And I was planning on grinding for her when she came around to the uh, basic arena. I was just going to go grab the uh, five star. Don't have to now. Now I have a champion that I can use the uh, rank up gems that I have on. Because I had no one to use them on. All right. Let me uh, turn that down a little bit. All right. Yeah, because I, I... Oh, man. Oh, I see what happened. I see what... Wow. Okay. So that's what happened. I opened up the wrong crystals. I opened up featured five-star crystals, not the basic five-star crystals. I'm glad I did. <laughs> okay, well... Let's get on down here because I don't want to do that for the uh, six star. That's for sure. Let's open up this uh, last one here. Let's just pop it. Wow. That was a, what you call a lucky accident because I did not mean to open up featured five stars. But I got the one champ that I would have wanted out of that. Okay. Um, so we're we're... I don't think I'm going to be able to get enough for six, but we do have the uh, Nexus crystal. So let me go ahead and put this one on the spinner. And we love dupes. We love dupes. Hold on. Let me grab the most wanted down here. All right. So you see down there, those are the champions that I would love to get the most. Uh, Juggernaut is probably my uh most wanted at this point uh i also want zemo but i don't know if you've heard but recently they made a change to the root mechanic which affected him really badly so he's not as desirable to me um as he was before all right and okay um i believe he's already awakened maybe i'll take him up a little bit he get his uh, SIG level up there. Oh, yeah. Look at that. He's already 60. Might have to do that. That could be annoying in uh, Battlegrounds for sure. Um, but, yeah. So, the root mechanic has been changed fundamentally from how it's worked from the beginning. And people are saying they really should. And I agree. They need to issue rank down tickets because people got Zemo and ranked him up specifically because of that mechanic. And if they don't give rank down tickets, well, I already don't trust them. And so I'm not surprised if they do stuff like that. Um, but for anybody that spent money to get the units to open up the crystals and all that good stuff, learn from this, learn from this. If they don't make it right, Learn from this. That's all I could tell you. Um, but I still want Baron Zemo, but not as much as I did. Tell you that. Um, simply because of that change. That's how bad of a change it was. All right. What do we got? Hello. I would have taken one over more. I need more uh, SIG levels on uh, Kingpin. This one eh, has the seven star shards, but... Uh, I would love to get more SIG levels on a champion that can use them. 
and who I use. You know, my my um, Kingpin is ranked three, and I use him in Battlegrounds all the time. He's great. All right. Let's keep going here. See what else we got. I wouldn't mind getting some more uh, SIG levels. I forgot what the SIG levels do on uh, Rintra as well. That'd be pretty cool. Um, we also have uh, Terax. Would love that. And, of course, any of these champions down here to awaken. Although, I wanted to awaken Falcon. I still do. He doesn't really need it. But, he's there as a 7-star. I was considering taking Falcon up to rank 4. But I was just waiting for him to be awakened. But now he's available as a 7-star. Probably not going to do that. At least not anytime real soon. All right, what do we got? All right, just skipped on over that Stripe. And I don't really use Stripe, so... But he does need his uh, Awakened ability. And uh, I know with the right uh, Synergy, Night Thrasher is actually pretty decent. But I don't use him. These are all champs that I still have at rank 1. Just not not that useful. I wonder if that's how it, it can tell. It's like, well, if you have them at rank one, chances are you're not really wanting to use them. So let's let's just uh, wait the random a little bit to the champs you don't have ranked up. And give you every once in a while, we'll give you some champs you have ranked up. Who knows? Um, but anyway, trying to think of who else I wouldn't mind uh, SIG levels on. I see... Future Ant-Man. I need to add him to the uh, most wanted because I actually do want uh, Future Ant-Man. I, I saw him. I see him uh, in the reel here. He is definitely one of uh, the champs I want. Um, other than that, I don't think there's anybody I'm just burning to get. I probably want Future Ant-Man more than I want... Um, wow. What's up with these champs? I mean, I'm happy to get the um, the seven-star shards, but what's up with this? I'm so happy that I'm getting seven-star shards because otherwise this would be horrible. Anyway, um, yeah, other than I think Juggernaut and uh, Future Ant-Man. Those are two that I want probably the most right now. Um, Baron Zemo, third. Okay. Um, trying to see if there's anybody else here that will remind me. Because um, I don't always remember who goes into the, uh, um, into the basic pool. But yeah, I definitely, definitely want future Ant Man, and if he when when he comes around to the basic, I will definitely be going for him in the basic arena. Um, but yeah, so I wonder if we're gonna get any champ that's uh, somewhat decent, somebody that I want some sigs on, maybe. I don't mind the dupes, but you know, anybody. <laughs> And the answer is no. The answer is absolutely, positively no. Um, I think that every single champion that I just pulled from here is rank one. I believe so. I think every champion that you just saw me get is still rank one. Meaning, I don't use them, and I'm not really all that crazy about them. There are a few that I'm just waiting uh, to take up. But interesting. Interesting indeed. All right. Well, let me see. We do have a Cavalier Crystal. Let's get our three-star out of here. Hoo-ya! A three-star torch! Exciting! All right. Um, oh, wait. I got another three-star. Hold up. Hey. Stop doing that. Ooh -rah! 
and an Iron Patriot even better than the uh, uh, Human Torch. Okay, <laughs> enough of all that mess. Um, let's see. Let's get this, and let's see if we got anybody that's not level one that I can use the Sig levels on, or maybe even a new champion. All right, and bam. What do we got in here? Doom, doom, doom. Oh, we do have a new champion though. I mean, it's Iron Fist, but it is a new champion. And I will definitely take that. Y'all know I'm a, an arena grinder, so I like them new champions. And I mean, Silver Centurion, if I want to awaken him, I can. Um, and the champion is already awakened. Um, so yeah, I'm going Iron Fist. So we got a new champion, so that's a good thing. Uh, no Seven Star Shards. I remember the day when Iron Fist used to be really good. I wonder if they'll ever uh, make Iron Man great again. I don't know. Anyway, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought of the video. And next uh, level up, I will be taking a new champion to rank five. So stay tuned for that. Take care, and you all have a blessed day.